Oh! Oh. Okay, that was weirdly a jump scare when he freaked out, because I didn't expect that. Oh no. Sorry for hold up. Undeni unbelievable tragic disaster. Over. Did you lose something else? Must soldier on making second attempt now. Over. Uh, Alright, are you sure you're. Over. <laughs> Over. Out for a hike. Oh. Take it in the pouch of the drawer and load it with another red marble and another green marble. Oh. Oh, and he looks so sad now. Oh. Oh, I feel so bad for Jude. Oh, you poor thing. You're right. Betrayal. Over. Abandonment. The lowest, vilest, cowardice. Over. Um, well, can't even communicate true degree of outrage. Likely to jeopardize mission if emotion not suppressed. Over. Uh, and coming over and out. Oh, Langley. Langley the coward. Langley the blackguard. Langley the unspeakable. A thousand deaths, a million deaths, an infinitude of deaths would not be enough. Langley warm-hearted, Langley bile blood, Langley. You hate him with everything you are and ever will be, Langley. Why do you hate that one? I'm guessing their names are a reference to something else. Hands are definitely not shaking as you pluck two more marbles from the safe cozy compartments to the drawer and drop them in the depths of the pouch's waiting leathery maw. Oh. Oh, the music. Oh gosh. Oh, <laughs> the music. Langley. Yeah, Langley did it, mostly. But... Oh. Third time's the charm. Success! Jeez, and Crow Byers, my boy's so brave, so true, so great. Actually, just point blank losing your mind right now. It may be kind of relief after years of build-up, but you could have picked a better night for it. Mission accomplished! Byers, champion of champions, waiting for you in the kitchen. Over. Why? Over. Oh, Byers, his marbles required to acquire a key. Over. All right, I guess that sort of makes sense. New development, Byers, being menaced. Please hurry. Over. What? Oh, okay, I'm on it. Hurry, please, Joey. He's all I have left. Over and out. Okay, so that's Byers. He was upset that Lingley abandoned him. That was it. Okay. Also, this thing's cute. It's an Elbridge. A f I, do I butchered that. A folk art monster from Oaxaca, Mexico. Carved out of the wood of a copal tree. This little thing used to creep you out really bad until you babysit it and you learn more about it. Turned out they're based on monsters and artists saw in his dreams, and ever since then he's been a lot more friendly. It's really cute. I love it. So I didn't realize he was yelling at the one that left, not the one that was remaining. Oh, wait, kitchen this way. I'm here to save the bird. It that bat has fists. Did I get a sneak attack strife? Can I like actually just like whack it? Hey, over here! Oh, he doesn't have eyes. Pardon me, boy. Can you give me a shine? Can I hit him now? Oh, I keep just trying to blind him. Can I... Uh, here, have some spice. Oh, that, that works, I guess? No. So now, do I need to give him treats? 
Oh, never mind. Is there anything I can, like, use? Oh! Don't punch the fridge. Is there anything around I could use? There's that. Can I, like... Can I throw batteries at something? Can I... Okay, that's fine. I guess I'll just keep tapping at him. Nope, okay. So I need to tap at him to get him close. And then... It's not the treat. I can't use that. I can't... Spice didn't work, treat didn't work, key didn't work. Some batteries? Nope. Bye, Joe. Okay. Oh, maybe I should use something on the bird. That makes sense. Can I, like, treat the bird? Can I, Can I do anything? Oh, like slip past, slip past you now? No, nope. okay. Well, this is fun. Puzzle here. I feel like I've used everything, because flashlight doesn't do anything because he's blind. Tap I thought would get me past the birds. Spice didn't do it. Really nothing did it. Can I Can I use anything? Tough crowd, maybe something with a little more flash. But Oh my god, that get him that got him like staring. So then can I like spice him? Oh, the spice really didn't agree with him. Oh, it killed him! Mixed success. I mean, fair enough. Joey, thank you for tact tactical tactically brilliant seasonings murder. Byers has payload, repeat Byers has payload! Over. Thanks, um, do you know how I might get him down? He's pretty terrified. Negative, Byer simply has unfortunate mercenary streak. Should respond to ent enticement. How do you grab a pigeon? Sounds like a setup for a riddle, or perhaps a joke. Over. Bye, Jude. Over and out. Can I look at the thing I killed? Here, do you want a treat? I'll do if you aren't sure if these are safe for birds. Of the violent strangled death of the monster, you're a little nervous about just feeding things to other things at random. Maybe there's something safer around here, like bread? Bread-like, at least. Something bread-like. Uh, I guess we'll see if there's... No, no snacks. Oh, okay. A single cracker. Oh. <laughs> I like that it's a 3D modeled cracker, or at least, no, maybe? All you can read from this meager cabinet is the stalest, tiniest, worst cracker. You like the terrible cracker? Success! This little fellow, Byers, you think? Yes, you're pretty sure. This is Byers. Gobbles down the stale cracker as you tuck him into your pocket. He's got a little parcel around his neck. We're trying to letting him hold on to this until you actually figure out what you're supposed to do with it. I already know. Although I guess she doesn't know. Oops, wrong way. No, I don't. Let me just. You carefully remove the marble pouch from around his neck, and believe it or not, shove the marbles in the empty eye sockets. You scarred the pouch. 
What an evening it's been. Your pa's love of globes knows no bounds, but you recognize you don't recognize the countries on this one. You have a better idea of what you're looking for if you could read these scribbly labels. Oh, you can make sense of the X mark. Could you indicate treasure? Okay, got the marbles. Do you want me to send the pigeon back? No! Okay. Sorry, didn't mean to shout. Just worried about please protect buyers. This chance of surviving return trip, very remote. Over. Oh yeah, good point. Seems pretty dicey out there. Affirmative. Over. I'll just use the marbles or whatever then. I'll let you know how it goes. Affirmative. Good luck, sis. Over and out. Okay, I thought maybe he would say what to do, but whatever. Oh hey, I key. You did it. The other key has been found. That's the most elaborate hiding spot. You got what you assumed to be out of the key. Got the key, heading back to the attic now. Careful, may not be that simple. What do you mean? None of this has been simple. It's been downright convoluted. Noticing hostile elements gripping serpents massing. Oh jeez. We'll try to back you up if possible. Main alert, sis. Over. Hey, always in, bro. Over and out. Alright. So, serpent army, apparently. Maybe? Oh. Oh shit! They're all mouths and arms. Well, or wings, I guess. Oh! That one actually has an eye! Wait, what? Can I... Hey, wait! Oh! Okay. Joey is currently knocked out and has nothing to say about this brute squad. Maybe someone else can help you. No. I feel like he should have run over instead of just shooting from the window, but oh well. Okay, that got their attention even though they don't have eyes? Sure, I guess. Can I flashlight him? You swallow your hole, alright. Can I... There's no getting past the behemoth right now. Focus on the relatively smaller ones. Okay. And what can I do? Can I... I'll just tap dance him, I guess? Okay. Ooh, okay, that did something. So I guess it's swapping time. Can I egress? Okay, I guess I'll just... Can I shoot again? This seems to be working out pretty well. Now I guess do the same thing? Because apparently they're that dumb. Can I... Oops. Oh, I dodged. Mama said knock you out. Call out a comeback. It's all Pavlova for you. I guess that's just what's going on now. So can I shoot another one? Oh, that... Oh, God! <laughs> oh. oh, you doof. Oh, God! I mean, that worked? It seems very upset about the fire, which is interesting. Alright. Gosh, I hope Joey's okay. You wonder how she's doing right now. Okay, I can't. Oh! Real bad! What? Uh. Oh shit! You can get a game over! Well, alright then. Okay, don't. Don't switch then. Let's, let's 
key this up. Oh, gosh. Oh, well, all right. We're I'm locked in here forever now. That's fine, though. Joey, come in. Please report status. Joey, hello, it's Jude. Joey, are you okay? P Joey, please, over. Yes, I'm safe. I'm in the attic. Just barely made it. Phew, over. Locked in, actually. I dropped the key. Safer in attic, then rest of house. Key can be retrieved later. Over. I think you were right. The way they smashed through the living room window and the front door? If I stayed in my room, I'd be goner. Separated, with, sep separated us with Vanguard. Disabilized power. Probed defenses. Finally attempted entry through multiple points of ingress. Basic siege tactics. Over. I actually know this stuff? I didn't realize you actually knew this stuff. I kind of just thought you liked pretending to be a spy or whatever. Well, take it as a compliment. Over. Anyway, thanks. So I'll just hope here for now, I guess. Are you safe in the treehouse? Should you try calling your friends or something? Didn't want to risk their involvement. Always a gamble engaging soldiers of fortune. But maybe time. Main scare in location. Ignore object under curtain. Over. I'm not going to ignore it. Well, obviously, I'm not going to ignore it. Joey, please. Over. What? It's a big and serious thing under a beguiling, fluttery curtain. I have to at least peek at it. What is it anyway? Data insufficient to determine. Over. Well, I'll let you know when I find out. Joey, don't tactic. Er, and app. Over. You, you there? Jo, jo, uh, no, oral. It's a uh, really bad. I, over. Jude, can you repeat that? Lots of static. Jo, please. I can't use you to. Please do, don't go near the portal. Over. Do you say portal? I think it was, I can't lose you too. I, that seems kind of sad. Well, it turns out you live in a house with a hand and jar in it. You must never carry this knowledge with you forever. You've left the, art, the item hanging long enough. In fact, as you stare at the gross desiccated hand in the jar, you begin to suspect that the time for you to break open this jar and slap it in an arm's dead hand against your own alive hand has tragically passed. Okay, that's fine. The world is in crisis, so only Captain Planet were here. Then the monsters could eat him. And you could easily escape while they were distracted. <laughs> you put this in the attic yourself, because it weirded you out that Pa had a lamp shaped like a woman's leg. Let you know he'd soon graduate to lamps shaped like entire women. This another victim of Jude's overzealous crowd crowbarring, no doubt. Any chance it gets to go prying and jimmying, the kid just goes nuts though. So I'm guessing this is what the portal was in? Handwriting is barely legible. It's no return address, leaving you with no more information than before you looked at it. Now, this really isn't that kind of mystery. The boring kind where you have to frequently refer to other, your rigorously maintained collection of shipping invoices in order to make any progress. You hate those. Okay, fine. Look, your pa's passion for previously alive artifacture has always given you the willies. What is it with him? Not only does he not respect the lives of critters he shoots, he seems infatuated with the notion of death itself. What a twisted jerk. Consider mummy. You draw strength from the mummy's unsaleable calmness. You are stronger now, having considered the mummy at length, so you're going to go ahead and stop considering the mummy. Since he got his first best shotgun, this one fell out of favor and now primarily functions as the home of a thick layer of attic dust. Meanwhile, its favorite brother is living out in this shotgun's daydream in the hands of your paw. Lock and load. There's no chance you're going to pick up this gun. You certainly aren't going to lock and load anytime soon. It just isn't going to happen. There's a creepy portal. I have to touch it. You can't avoid noticing the drape rustling around, although you really wish you could. Better see what's under there now, though, before it gets the drop on you. Ooh, ominous and spooky. Also, I love these animated scenes. They're so simple, but really cute and well animated. Oh my gosh, the thing is elaborate. Oh, these are the schematics he had. And red and green again. That's interesting. Okay. And, oh, the the key, the swirls. Because that's a green swirl, and that's a red swirl, and that's a red and green swirl. So it matches the... So your mom's artifact is the thing for the... Oh, okay. Keyhole, it calls out your mind. Wait, what? You... Key. You picture heirloom. Key. Get it. Use it. Start it. Now, now, now! Key! Woo! Key! Woo! Interesting. 
You have no idea what this is. You don't know where it came from or how long it's been there. Did you know about this? Is that why he really sent you to the attic? No, that, that doesn't make sense. He... Did your pa know? It looks like kind of different than the stuff he usually dumps off here. Feels different in your mind, at least. You... Wait, what? You... You're having trouble thinking clearly. Trouble keeping your train of thought. How... How long have you been standing here? You don't know how to operate this thing except, of course, to put a key in it and turn it. That seems like the obvious thing, doesn't it? Like the most obvious and necessary thing you've ever known, and we're always going to do, and I've always known, and do it, do it, do it now, 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 the key! Do it! Do it! Open the door! Okay, this is weird, okay. I think I know what's going on, but I don't want to say. You feel like you, you should somehow, like you're always going to? It's a difficult sensation to describe, even to yourself, but what goes in there? Can I look at it? Okay, I wasn't sure if it was like, there'd be any extra dialogue about it. Big spooky red- oh, what the fuck? Uh, that key... okay, that wasn't what I expected key to do. Oh, no, a timer? Okay, this thing is creepy as hell, but actually really rad. Oh, it has lasers. This seems bad. Oh, and there's a ceiling. Oh, shit. Oh, no. She went up in the green laser? And that's a troll going down in the red laser. And we had our title. <laughs>